What did you find in my office, driver? Oh, nothing. I think an animal got in and set the alarm off. Some sort of stubborn mule. Not again. This is why I told you not to store carrots in there, idiot! So don't worry. No one knows you're working for Vinnie Papalardo. Excellent. What? You looked at my records! Sorry, I, I couldn't help it. But wow, Vinnie Papalardo is one heck of a criminal. Maybe so, but unlike me, Vinny Papalardo has quite a temper. What? I am very mild-mannered! You're fired! Also, he doesn't trust anyone. Not since Mo, his right-hand man, got arrested. <laughs> huh. Vinny would probably be really grateful to anyone who could help with that. Oh, yes. You could just steal a prison truck and then pick him up outside the courthouse where he's being sentenced today. Wait a minute. You're not thinking about joining his crew, are you? You're my driver! Not for much longer. If I can get Mo out of jail, that could be my way into Vinny's gang and get me one step closer to Rex. Hey, Chase. What you need? What can you tell me about Vinny Papalardo's right-hand man? Mo DeLuca? He's not actually a criminal, he's just Vinny's cousin. So why is he being sentenced? Uh, let me check. <laughs> wow, 412 unpaid parking violations. Parking tickets? So, I suppose it won't really matter if he doesn't go to jail. What are you up to, Chase? Chan is working for Vinny, and I'm pretty sure Vinny is working for Rex. But to get in with Vinny, I'll need him to trust me. By busting out Mo DeLuca? That doesn't sound very by the book. It's the only lead I've got. Does the department have a prison transport truck I can borrow? Maybe. Try Chuck. He's outside the back of the station. I'll tell him you're coming. Hey there, Officer McCain. I've been expecting you. Great. So do you have a prison transport I can use? I sure do, but I could get into a lot of trouble from lending it out. Then maybe there's something I could- Perfect! You read my mind. Grab that box and follow me. Dump the box down over here. It's a bike I mail ordered. Oh man, they didn't include the wheels. Think you can find some spares? That's one. Find another. It ain't a unicycle.
that's two. Find another. It, oh, wait, uh, I'm thinking of tricycles. Well, it looks real nice. I wonder if it's safe to ride. Well, I guess there's only one way I'm gonna find out. You should take it out for a spin. Just once round Cherry Tree Hills and Auburn Dock should do. Oh. and it's still in one piece. A deal is a deal. You'll find the prison transport truck in there.
This ain't the last you've seen of Moda Luca. I can do this sentence standing on my head. Thanks to my circus trainers. There's the paperwork. We won't be seeing Mo DeLuga back on the street for at least eight years. Thanks to those parking tickets. Another job done and the final day of my 36 year long career finished. And all without a single blemish. Hey Pat, I'm here for Mo DeLuca. <laughs> hey, you okay back there, Mr. DeLuca? I ain't talking to you. Just shut up and take me to Albatross. If you insist. But I don't really work for the prison, so we can go somewhere else if you like. What? Oh, man. I know Vinny come through for me. What's your name, kid? Jace. Don't know you? Don't care. Take me to the usual hideout. Actually, I work for Chen Chuang. But I'm sick of it. I arranged this escape because I want to work for a real criminal. Aha! Shows you got guts, Chase. Cedar Street. That's where the hideout is. Looks like they figured out what I'm up to. This might get bumpy. If it gets me out of an eight-year stretch, it can make it as bumpy as you like. Getaways go! I give this one 7 out of 10. That's not bad, kid. I can see why Chan hired you. You're pretty good at driving. Nostalgic for the time Jimmy Squareleg stuffed me in his trunk and drove me over the border. Happy days. Hey! We're getting close. So, do you really want to jump ship to Vinny's crew? Yeah. Huh. I might be able to swing something. I mean, you're good with me, kid. But Vinny, he's another case altogether. You're gonna have to do something really special to get in with him. Whatever it takes, Mr. DeLuca. Come around the back and let me out. Thanks. Mo! You escaped! We was just formulating a plan to bust you out of Albatross for Vinny! Too late. This kid beat you to it. Now get rid of that truck! Thanks, Chase. I'll be in touch. Hey, Chase, I think I found your in with my cousin Lenny. That was fast. What is it? My brother-in-law works at the airport. Said they got some shipment of fancy high-tech gizmos in from a security company out east. I know for a fact that Vinny would really like to get his hands on them. And how do I get my hands on them in the first place? Ah. Okay. I don't usually like to do jobs myself, but you did me a real solid back at the courthouse. So I'll help you out this once. Meet me in a car park south of the airport. I'll get right over there.
hope Mo doesn't take long. Hey, Chase! I hope I didn't keep you waiting. Not at all. This car is for you. It belongs to my brother, who I don't get on with. So feel free to damage it. Don't worry. With my driving, that's a guarantee. Whoa! And that's the truck you gotta stop. Get in the car! Great! Now floor it! Anyway, so thank you very much. You're actually doing me a favor. Nice driving, Chase. I think you're gonna be a real asset to the crew. Now get the truck to Vinny's restaurant. He might not know you, but trust me, that shipment will smooth it over nicely. Whoa! I've been speaking with the mayor's office, and she says you can do whatever you need to and charge any costs to the department. Whatever it takes to catch Rex Fury. Your timing couldn't be better. I just took a delivery truck without permission. Don't worry. I already started a tab for you after Frank told me about the car you took for Chan. Frank actually passed that on? I'm impressed. Well, he was gonna try asking Santa, but he checked with me first. I think he's starting to learn from his mistakes. I kind of feel proud of him. Hmm. I'll keep you updated if I have to take anything else, Ellie. Vinny Papalardo ran the biggest gang in Lego City. And now, he wanted to see me. His ice cream parlor was a gathering place for local hoodlums. There was Tony one time. So called because he said everything once. Hey! Polly blindfolds. No, tell him I can't see him today. Lucky Pete. Good to see ya! Whoa! Don't do it! Hey, I found the penny! Ugh. The Crayfish Twins. <gasps> Sorry, wrong table. And Mikey Spoilers. Check it out. When you get to the Space Center, you can knock down a planet from the ceiling to get a secret item. I'm here to make you laugh? You think I'm funny? Funny how? Uh, 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 I'm sorry, boss. I didn't Get mean to- Get out of here and unload that truck! <coughs> hey, you must be Chase. You come highly recommended. I won't forget what you did for my cousin. Oh, ignore the clothes, kid. It's my boy's birthday. I wanted to give him a nice surprise, you know? I've been looking forward to getting my hands on the stuff you got me for some time. They're called color guns, and they're of particular benefit to the less than legitimate fraternity. You know, us guys. Now, I need someone to see if these things really work by stealing the Bell Pepper Emerald from the Lego City Bank in downtown. 
You want to put one through its paces? Well, I've come this far. That's right. And don't worry about how to use it. I'll have a read through these instructions and phone them through to you. Good luck, Chasey. Sorry, it's an emergency. Ellie, I'll have another thing for the tab soon. I'm about to break into a bank vault. Ugh, which one? The Lego City Bank at downtown. No problem. You need any help getting in? Sure. Okay, right. There's an entrance to the sewer in the gardens opposite the bank. Whoa, wait. Sewer? I can't just walk in the front door? It's a bank vault. The only way in is via a ventilation hatch on top of it. And the only way to that is via the sewer. Did you expect a red carpet? No. <sighs> Fine. Thanks, Ellie. to shower for a week after this. Hey, Chase, you in the bank? I'm in a sewer. Wow, did you take a wrong turn? <laughs> I'm kidding. I've been reading the instructions for the color gun. Yeah? Yeah. You're gonna need to fill it from a color swapper. That sounds like an unusual thing to find in the sewer. I agree. I just have this weird feeling there'll be one down there. I hope the Lego City PD gets discounts from a dry cleaner. I really don't want to know how this key ended up in a sewer. But I do want to know how come it fits this lock. What a significant looking red panel that is. <sighs> Why couldn't I learn to swim backstroke? Ooh, it smells like these pipes are used to carry sprouts.
I guess that's a color swapper then. The gun's got some kind of green stuff in it now. Great! Now, if you see any electrical panels which are glowing red, you can shoot them with that thing to turn them on. Ooh, I saw one back there over a gate. You know, I've always wanted to see this bell pepper emerald. They say it's as big as your head. Used to belong to some royal dame, but she sold it, cause wearing it as a brooch gave her back trouble. I'll be in touch. I just read some more. Keep a lookout for a red color swapper. Right, red color swapper. Oh, this emerald. It's meant to be the most flawless one in the world. Not like those useless lumps of crystal they get out of the bluebell mine. I mean, they're valuable, but uh, this thing, whoa. <laughs> tries flushing an air mattress down the toilet. On that color swapper. Once you fill the color gum with red, you can use it to turn off electrical stuff by shooting any green electrical panels. You know, this is actually kind of like the old days when I used to rob banks myself. Except that uh, I ain't the one who's risking his neck this time. I'll read up some more. Huh? 
Oh, I can almost taste that big old gemstone. The bell pepper emerald is gonna make me a fortune! You know someone that can handle the sale? No need. We're stealing it to order. I've been doing some work for a private buyer, and he wants it real bad. So don't mess up. The last guy who messed up? Oh, man. That was a real shame. What happened? I couldn't justify employing him anymore, so he's sleeping with the fishes now. What? Yeah, he's a night watchman at the aquarium. I'll be in touch. Better find the emerald and get out of here before someone catches me. Hey, Chase, I got to the really good part of the manual. You can use the color gun to turn things silver. That kind of defeats the point of me robbing a bank, doesn't it? It's not real silver, but it's close enough to make stuff all shiny and reflective. Useful if there are laser beams around. Capiche? Yeah, that might be handy in this place. Great. Just fill it with silver color if you see a swapper. And keep a lookout for the bell pepper emerald. Call me when you get out of the vault. Huh. Well, the emerald wasn't in there. Not in there either. Almost like they don't want anyone to take the emerald. Is a jewel. 
Whoever's in here, you are breaking the law! I think they probably already know that, Phil. I guess I'm not getting out of here undetected, then. Maybe it's part of a combination. Well, it only seems fair I do something nice for the bank, too. That super build needs a lot of bricks. Jet-powered snowplow! Hey! I was about to rob this place! Sorry! I meant to have this place on Tuesdays, but the people listen to me? No! And they call this organized crime.
shot the emerald. Hey, good work, Chasey boy. I'll send you the location of the drop off. And if I get any of the jobs, I'll give you a call. Thanks, Vinny. There you go, one ridiculously massive emerald. You're welcome. Huh, not bad for my first bank job. Uh, I mean, only bank job. <laughs> Don't get sucked in by the glamour of the lifestyle, Chase. Chief? So far, you've cost this department an expensive sports car, a prison transport, and a delivery truck full of electronics. Am I missing anything? The bell pepper emerald? Huh? What? That thing's worth hundreds of thousands. You're gonna bankrupt us. Why did you do that? To get in with Vinny Papalardo's gang. Chan was working for him. You got into Papalardo's gang? We've been trying to pin a crime on him for years. So, you don't need Chan anymore. Okay. I've got a job for you. You're gonna get me photographic evidence against Chan's key gang members. Then we're gonna arrest them. And with a bit of luck, one of them will give us something against Chan. I'll need to buy a camera then. You've cost us enough. Just use your communicator's camera. If you can't figure it out, you can call Officer Phillips for help. Oh! Hey, Ellie. Chief said you could help me figure out the camera on my communicator. No, I didn't even know it had one. Oh, that's odd. Let me check your device remotely. Ah, uh, there's your problem. You're running old software. I'll update it. There you go. I even stuck on some new ringtones for you. See? Thanks. I need to get some evidence against the key players in Chan's outfit. Easily done. Just get in a good position to observe them and follow the instructions on the camera. It's foolproof. Ellie? All I got were photos of my face instead of the suspects. <laughs> <sighs> but not Frank proof.
Before I get some photos, I'd better find out what deals are going down today. If I stake out the noodle bar opposite Chan's scrapyard, I might get lucky and overhear their plans during lunch. Looks like my hunter is right. Okay, gang. It's that time of the week again. We gotta pay up all these guys we've been having steal cars for us, so listen up. Hey, you're meeting Ray on the balcony of the pharmacy. Lee, Bobby's waiting for you in the alley next to Chance. And Fang, you're gonna take delivery of a rare car from Blake at the limo place. If you understand your jobs, then remain perfectly silent. Excellent. Off you go. You know, we'd make a lot more profit if we just stole cars ourselves. Proof of three crimes in three different locations. How on earth am I gonna get photographic evidence against all of them? Wait, what if I wasn't on earth? If I get on top of the pagoda in the park, I could see all of those meeting points. Let's see if Ping's got to the pharmacy yet. And picture number one is uploaded. Nice. I really got his bad side. Now we can trace that boat theft back to you, Ping. Next up, Lee in the alleyway. Caught in the act, Lee. Naughty boy. I just need a shot of Feng receiving that stolen car, and I'm done. Ah, oh, fuzzy wuzzle. That's Feng with the cars obscured. I need to get a closer shot. That is definitely the stolen car. Hey, yo! Stop that! Did 
Did I remember my wallet? McCain! Chief? I'm looking at the pictures you just uploaded. I don't think anyone's gonna pay you to photograph their wedding, but they'll just about do as evidence. That was almost a compliment. Anyway, I've got undercover officers arresting the other gang members you photographed. So if Chan calls you, you know nothing. I don't want anything spooking him until we can get one of his gang members to testify against him. Yes, Chief. Wow, 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 wow.